what's up gorgeous welcome back to another video as you can see the backdrop is not up and this is the video where i explain that to begin i'll be doing my makeup duh this is a makeup channel actually we'll talk about that in just a minute but i am doing a full face of lipsticks while talking to you bit i'm not really talking about the makeup that i'm doing i'm just trying to put the lipstick on my face as always the products will be listed in the description below this video will be video number 24 and you will finally learn a little bit about me. This is not my color at all, but it's the only nude that I have. What up? I'm Jared. I'm 19 and I never learned how to read. Just kidding. Hi, my name is Shaylin. 14 of you guys have been subscribed to me and I've never even said that much in a video. By the way, we used to have 15 subs but one of y'all left so if you're still watching this and you're the person that unsubscribed please come back i miss you this does have pretty good coverage though i'm just gonna let myself set this with like baby powder but since it's a matte lipstick i kind of feel like maybe i don't even really need to so i'm just gonna move on to my eyebrows so, more about me, I guess, huh? Well, I can't really stop staring at this. So, yes, I'm in class of 2020. That red thing is a lot of the inspiration of why I want a personal channel. Oh, by the way, this video is me talking about having a personal channel. I don't think I've said that yet. But because of that red thing which is my scholarship school um i'm about to have a major life change so i think now is the best time if any to start one and my roommate actually there's four roommates we're going to be in a suite but the one that's actually in my room. We've talked about doing like a channel together. So I think that'll be really interesting to see how that goes. Now I know why I usually have a backdrop up. My wall is distracting. Let me finish this brown and I'll tell you about it. My eyebrows don't match, but that never happens. These are my canvases. I'll probably sell some of these soon. That's my hippie wall. I really want a Volkswagen bus van whatever you want to call it. That's a Gryffindor poster. That's a note from my best friend. Love her. If you haven't seen the video with her in it, go check it out. It'll be up there somewhere. That's a stuffed dollar bill I won at a fair. Um, that's a sign that says, yeah, not all who won are lost, which is what that canvas says. But that's two things I got at Jekyll Con. One's um, Stranger Things, the other one's Zombie. That's a drawing of Harley Quinn that I got. I'll link his stuff. Joker poster, cap and gown, butterfly sticker, stitch, more canvases that I've painted. I didn't paint that one, my sister did. And that one. Um, what about me? You wanna see my bag? Hold on. So if that wall doesn't tell you anything about me and the fact that I'm wearing pajama pants that are nightmare before Christmas, here's my bag where you can see my Oogie Boogie um, flashback to when I was Oogie Boogie. That'll be up there from Jekyll Con. I met him at Jekyll Con from Germspire Designs. There's another Oogie Boogie, Harry Potter, Peter Pan, Harry Potter, um, Nirvana, Brains from iZombie. Um, SS Georgie, Umbrella Academy, Music, Spill the Tea, Stitch, Panic at the Disco, Pizza Planet, Hi, Tripod, oh. can I finish this video? Um, I'm doing a full face of lipstick. Aliens, awkward but still friendly. Is that me or what? Tripod, in a minute. Um, I'm fine, it's fine, everything's fine. My sister wants her tripod. The audacity. Um, 
yeah so that's all of that and I, uh, I think that's all I'm going to tell you about me for right now so there'll be a Q&A the next video which will be possibly the first video I put on the personal channel but um there will be places for you to leave me questions on Instagram, TikTok, here so make sure you comment down below if you have any questions so why a personal channel? So like I said, I'm about to have this life change, and so if I'm gonna do one, now would be the best time. And it would give me m more opportunity to do content that I want to do, like I could do internet challenges and more fun videos like that. It'll give me um, another way to bond with my roommates more between us doing stuff for the videos. Um, I feel like with just having the makeup channel, I'm only restricted to makeup because it's a makeup channel. But there's more that I want to do. And also with um, the makeup channel, this is not going anywhere. In fact, I see this as more of an opportunity to create better content on the makeup channel. That's going to be terrible contour. And because I won't be posting there as often as the new channel will become my main but that just gives me more time between videos on this channel so I can create better looks that might take a little bit more effort to complete like more FX looks like right now I've got two started and I can't finish them right now just because I don't have everything I need for it But doing it this way where I've got the personal channel where I can create more of what I want and still keep up the makeup channel, it'll prevent me from just like stopping any type of social media altogether because especially recently, I've thought about it a lot. Also, I'm sure it just gets boring you just watching me do makeup. Like, there's only so much variety I can put in this. And if I start to get bored with it, I know you are. And I don't want that. Speaking of the makeup channel, you know that there's a little series on there that I like to do called Soul Searching. And that series is also going to remain. But it's going to look a little bit different. Because, um... I don't have all the details worked out yet, but I've got a plan. That was a little bit too much on that side. But other than me just putting too much of the blush on, I think we're looking pretty good so far. It doesn't look that bright in person, but it's picking up on camera a lot more. So what I'm doing for the eyes is just putting makeup on the lipstick on my hand and dipping the brush in it. Um, this is the third time I've filmed any type of video about just talking about the idea of having a makeup channel. Um, the first one I started in the middle of me cleaning my car out. I was cleaning the interior and I just started filming while in the car. While cleaning. And, um, I just, I don't know what happened to that video. And the last one I probably would have uploaded, but I ruined the makeup last minute um, with eyeliner and I didn't like it. So I just wanted to restart this and then also now it'll be two separate videos. The last two I w was like answering questions in this video, but I just decided I wanted it to be me just putting the idea out there of the channel and saying what type of response I get. That way I have time to get details sorted out for that channel. Social media isn't something I started with the idea of I'm gonna get famous off of this because I knew that would just be like kind of dumb but it was just something that's fun for me like I play around and do my makeup like this on my own so I was like why not just go ahead and film it someone else might enjoy it but 
um, I, like, my TikTok videos are getting more views than I've ever, ever, ever expected. So thank y'all for that. For TikTok, I was getting excited when views were getting like a hundred or so, but there's some that have reached over a thousand. One's got like 1600 something. So that to me is still kind of crazy, but exciting. If you're someone who doesn't follow me there or you haven't seen my stuff there then like go check it out you might like it more than this if there's anything in particular you want to see me do on the personal channel then go ahead and let me know that I have some ideas of what I want to do but if you have something you want to see me do, then let me know. For my mascara, I'm just taking my spoolie into this gray. This was already broke. I kind of expected that. And last but not least is lipstick. I've tried to use a different lipstick for every process. I'll finish that off with a gloss, just for fun. That's the finished look. I'll take pictures and all so you can kind of see it a little bit better. I know the makeup's harder to see without the backdrop. I just wanted those elements to be here so you can get a little bit more feel of me and who I am. Um, my sister wants her tripod back so I'm going to finish this video. I hope you enjoyed. Like and subscribe if you haven't subscribed already and remember to let me know i'll put up on instagram and tiktok and everywhere that i've got anything of where you can ask me questions for the q a video that will be next so 